Mike Moore Media, the first place to hear Rockingham County news and information. Rockingham County Today is sponsored by Uptown Eden. The National Weather Service has issued a winter storm watch for Rockingham, neighboring North Carolina, and Virginia counties this evening through tomorrow evening. Heavy mixed precipitation possible, total snow and sleet accumulations up to two inches, and ice up to half an inch. We're looking at around 10 to 12 hours of glazing. The weather service says power outages and tree damage is likely, and travel may be almost impossible. A message from Rockingham County Public Health. Because of the forecast, COVID-19 vaccinations scheduled for Thursday have been rescheduled to Saturday. Rockingham County 911 received 153 calls last night. The main one, a house fire at 5096 U.S. 220 Business Stoneville. It was fully involved when crews arrived. Eight departments responded. Residents were displaced. I'll be posting additional information later this morning. Another minor fire in Reedsville. Other calls, mostly routine, medical, and domestic. At last night's Eden City Council Zoom meeting, four people were nominated and approved for the newly formed Parks, Open Space, and Greenway Commission. Carla McDonald, Matt Warren, Ed Wilson, and Roy Frazier. It was created to encourage public engagement and input. Jim Fink was appointed to the longstanding Historic Preservation Commission. An update on the Matrimony Creek Nature Trail. The State Fish and Wildlife Commission has finally determined a biological survey will not be needed. The city is working on a Corps of Engineers pre-construction notification and repairs on a washed-out sewer line and reinforcement of a bank part of the trail will hopefully start in about 60 days. Mayor Neville Hall thanked city crews for their work in the recent ice storm and said they're making preparations getting equipment ready for more winter weather tonight and tomorrow morning. The monthly report from Eden City Manager John Mindenhall includes a list of special events assuming COVID social restrictions are lifted. Spring grown and gathered May 20th, Piedmont Pottery Festival June 5th, Oink and Ale, June 19th. Shaggin on Fullcrest, July 24th. Summer Grown and Gathered, August 12th. Touch a Truck, August 21st. River Fest, September 17th and 18th. Heritage and Heroes, October 16th. Winter Fest, December 4th. Eden Parks and Recreation has scheduled the North Carolina Dixie Youth Baseball State Tournament for July 16th through 22nd at Freedom Park. Numbers in the news, $10 million. That's the amount basketball legend Michael Jordan is donating to launch two medical clinics in underserved communities in New Hanover County, not that far from where he grew up. It's a partnership with Novant Health. Jordan, who gave $7 million to open clinics in Charlotte, in the last several years, says everyone should have access to quality health care no matter where they live or whether or not they have insurance. Local is always best. Lane's is local. Lane's Family Pharmacy in Eden with countywide prescription delivery. Kevin and Keith Lane are a phone call away when you need them. 336-627-4600. Thousands of Rockingham County residents depend on lanes for delivery and the best selection of durable home medical equipment, supplies, and products. Call 336-627-4600 or stop in. Lanes is on Highway 14 in Eden near the hospital and doctor's offices. Lanes is family pharmacist owned. Now, Rockingham County weather today, sunny early, high 42, increasing clouds later, low 26, winter storm warning, midnight until 7 a.m. Friday. A significant mix of wintry precipitation expected, starting tonight as snow and sleet changing to freezing rain. Thursday, 
100% chance, high 34. Friday, a 40% chance, high 45. The weekend is looking nice, sunny, high in the low to mid 40s. Triad record highs and lows on this day, 79, 1927, 0, 1958. Get current weather information anytime at MikeMoore.media, along with Rocking Cam, our live stream weather camera. That's sponsored by Heat and Air Controllers. You can depend on them for year-round comfort, whatever the weather. Need a tow? Dave's Towing is a call away, 24 hours a day. Make sure you have this number handy. I have it in my phone, 336 932 7478 for Dave's Towing. AutomotiveMap.com presents the Sports Flash on Mike Moore Media. Men's college basketball tonight, the NC State Wolfpack. On the road at Pittsburgh, South Carolina visits number 19, Tennessee. Radford hosts Gardner-Webb, Western Carolina at Chattanooga. The Tar Heels at home against Northeastern. The Furman Paladins play host to Sanford. UNC Greensboro at VMI. Wofford hosts the Citadel. Wake Forest home against Duke. East Carolina's matchup at number 6, Houston, postponed. Clemson at Notre Dame, postponed. NBA tonight, the Hawks visit the Celtics. Atlanta looking to snap a four-game skid. The Hornets are off until this Saturday when they host the Golden State Warriors. Tonight's game against Chicago and Friday's game against Denver postponed due to COVID-19 protocols. On the ice, the Hurricanes are home against the Panthers. Carolina's won three straight. They have eight wins in their last ten. This update brought to you by the Score app. Download the free Score app today. It's one of the most popular sports apps in North America. That's the Sports Flash, Chuck Sanders, Mike Moore Media. A message now for my friend Ben Ferguson, owner of Ferguson Stump Grinding here in Eden. Ben has all the equipment for stump grinding, cleanup, and removal. And uh, I've seen this in work, uh, at work, an excavator to make uh, hard-to-mow uh, places like ponds, hillsides, and ditches a lot easier. He can take care of all of that for you. And I want you to check out his new website, fergusonstumpgrinding.com lots of pictures of recent jobs there fergusonstumpgrinding.com he'll do the job right for you now the community calendar sponsored by Night Owl National Stoneworks in Eden granite quartz and marble for commercial and residential on Facebook at Night Owl National Stoneworks Rockingham County Blood Drive at the National Guard Armory, NC-65 Reedsville, today, 11 to 3.30. Madison Med and Rotary Club, annual tasting extravaganza, Saturday, silent auction and art exhibition, a stroll through downtown Madison, 1 to 4, wine, hops, and appetizers. Clothing and food bag giveaway at the Fellowship on Barn Street, Reedsville, Thursday, February 25th, starting at 5. The Farmer's Market at Market Square, downtown Reedsville, is now accepting applications for vendors for the upcoming season. Get information at reedsvillenc.gov. Bill Ryan, owner of King's Inn Pizza Parlor in Eden, needs kitchen help. Apply in person with Bill at King's Inn, NC 14 Eden. That's Rockingham County's first pizza restaurant, opening in 1970. Shop local at these Uptown Eden Merchants. House of Health, sophisticated rubbish next to that little pork shop. Downtown Deli and Catering, Simply MK, Black Sheep Boutique Quilt Company, Five Star Realty, Salon 209, Hive, The Workshop, Sweet Revenge Bakery, Wagner Consulting, Perlina's Gift Baskets, The Roasted Bean, Revived Vintage, across from David Price Auto Works. Get your Uptown Eden Merchant discount card today. Now, today's Consumer Report. Police across America are reporting a rash of cases in which thieves are stealing catalytic converters from cars and trucks. The device uses a number of precious metals, including gold, platinum, and palladium. The prices of those metals have surged in recent months, creating a black market for the parts. 
New car prices continue to set records. Kelly Blue Book reports the estimated average transaction price for a light vehicle last month was nearly $41,000. New vehicle prices increased more than $2,100 from January 2020, while falling slightly from December. If a vitamin D supplement is not part of your daily diet, maybe it should be. Researchers at the German Research Center say a daily vitamin D supplement could be especially beneficial for older consumers' overall health and longevity. They say it can also reduce health care costs. I'm Mark Huffman. Learn more at ConsumerAffairs.com. It's Ash Wednesday, beginning the Lenten season, 46 days till Easter. It's National Cabbage Day. Oh, that sounds good for supper, doesn't it? Mm. Today in history... February 17th, 1878. The first large city telephone exchange opened. I'm emphasizing large in San Francisco. It had 18 phones. 1936, Bill Monroe, the father of bluegrass music, cut the first of about 60 records in a warehouse in Charlotte. Six days a week, the Monroe brothers did an early morning show on WBT in Charlotte. Those were the days. 1965, comedian Joan Rivers made her first guest appearance on The Tonight Show, starring Johnny Carson on NBC. She was on that show almost 100 times. Big-name birthdays, Michael Jordan, 58, Ed Sheeran, 30, Paris Hilton, 40, Denise Richards, 50, Jim Brown, 85, Lou Diamond Phillips, 59, and Larry the Cable Guy, 58. And close by, on the Birthday Club, just a couple of names today, Kayla Camp and Freddie Gilbert. Well, happy birthday to you, Kayla Camp and Freddie Gilbert. Let me know about upcoming birthdays, the person you tell me about may be our weekly winner on the Birthday Club with giveaways from Pizza Hut, Ingrid's Cupcakes and Confections, That Little Pork Shop, A.K. Emporium, Vernon Family Dairy, Wendy's, Carolina Fuels, Preppy Pirate Outfitters. We start the week on this program on Monday with Sunday and Monday birthdays, and I've got them all through the week, and then on Friday, Friday and Saturday. So that's Seven days covered right there on the Birthday Club. And then at the end of the week, I have a drawing, all of those names, Sunday through Saturday. And our winner gets that nice prize package from these Eden businesses. You can text birthdays to me anytime, 336-932-1881. Rockingham County today is sponsored by RiseUpReadsville.com. Colonial Funeral Home, Carpino Investments, All About Floors, Carolina Fuels, Tire Max, Fair Funeral Home, Shop RockinghamCounty.com. Well, that's our program for today. Thank you for tuning in. Hopefully, we'll be back together tomorrow. Let's finish with our motivational moment, and I've come across this from FDR. When you get to the end of your rope, tie a knot and hang on. Have a wonderful Wednesday, friends, and remember to count your blessings.